Hi guys, and thank you for getting out with me today. We're out here at Millstone Bluff, a nice little area. Looks like they've got some really nice paths. Great scenes right here from the parking lot. So stay with us. Just right outside the parking lot, it will uh, tell you a little bit about the trail and how the Millstone Bluff received its name from quarrying activity by the settlers from the past century. And the sandstone around the bluff was shaped into millstones for use in grinding grain. The millstone you see here is what was left behind. So we'll go check that out. And this was the stone they're talking about right here. On your way in, it is a nice gravel path that does work its way uphill. Not too steep though, so you'll have a fairly easy walk up and of course you've got periodic benches for stopping taking a breather so what they talk about on this trail here is they definitely want you to stay just on the trail this is an archaeological uh, study out here but they say along this trail, we'll be able to see uh, the remains of a stone wall, a community cemetery, some rock carvings, and some village dwellings. And uh, we can just imagine what, what happened years and years ago. And this area here was the community cemetery. Um, and people were buried in shallow stone-lined graves separated by family or larger group of relatives. Right out in here. And this right here would have been one of those graves. Here is a nice rocky overlook. Awesome. From this bridge, you get to see if you can find any of these images in these rocks right down here. I couldn't make any of them out. But hopefully, if you come, you can. I believe if you can see that right down there, that is the Thunderbird, and then the spider is right back here. Those, those were believed by the tribes to have magical powers, and those are still being utilized by Southeast tribes yet today. And this is telling us that the family homes were built in these small depressions in the ground you see here. And that a community building may have been right out in front here. Saying that the large flat area you see here was the community plaza which had several different buildings on it. Thank you for getting out with me today right out here at Millstone Bluff. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel right up here. And for other great hiking, biking, and kayaking videos, click right down here. Thanks for watching, guys.